This morning we are taking our series Generation Next to the farm to meet an eight-year-old tractor expert with a growing fan base on social media. NBC's Kathy Park spent the day with him. Kathy, I cannot wait to hear more about oh, this little boy. Oh, this is a great story. So I spent a day on the farm and learned so much from Jackson Locks. He's a tractor riding farming enthusiast who can tell you just about everything there is to know about farm life. His mom says he's been that way since he was a toddler. Even though he just wrapped up the third grade, Jackson is wise beyond on his years. Farming in South Whitley, Indiana is an unusual. It's a way of life for many who live here. But it's not every day someone from this small town goes big on social media. Oh, we got the new tractor. Meet Jackson Locks. He's eight. That's fun. This is the first one I ever had. But some say he's really going on 68. You change your oil right here. How often do you have to do that? I would say probably about every month. And you can do that? Yeah. Really? Spend a few minutes with Jackson, and it's like a master class on tractors and farming equipment. And then this is how you turn on your mower deck. This is your throttle, how high the engine speed you want. This is your choke. How do you know all this? I've just been taught it, and I've just learned it over And over you remember years. it all? Yeah. From the time he was two, he remembers things that happened in different points in his life. It just always blew our minds. I want to say 19. 2000, they probably made them. For the good and the bad, he remembers everything. <laughs> Think it acts on, it's comparable to this. His memory is spot on all the time. He's amazing that way, for sure. Yeah, I quit trying to fact check him because yeah. he's always right. He's so. always right. <laughs> <laughs> he probably likes hearing that. Uh -huh. Yeah. His knowledge. So that's doing the least amount of tillage you can. And quick wit. And what do they have you do? I'm kind of there just to keep him talking, keep the conversation going. <laughs> oh, that's all. Have made him a star on TikTok. Some videos racking up millions of views. That'd be a nice machine to have. Oh, yeah. It's got a nice price tag on it, too. It's somewhere around 50000 And what do you think about all the attention that you're getting? I think it's pretty cool. I, I, would, I would definitely say it's probably pretty cool. But it gets better. Just recently, John Deere, the iconic company known for manufacturing agricultural equipment and machinery, has brought him on board for unique collaboration. It's going to be fun, but I'm going to be training the new chief tractor officer. What were you thinking when John Deere came calling? Blown away. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we yeah. both grew up on farms with John Deere. Yeah. You know, it's equipment we've always used. So. I've said it's like the mothership calling home. <laughs> really. At eight years old. Yeah. <laughs> but before there's any content creating, class always comes first. Mound. Goats. Goats. Are we going to get goats? I'd like to. Mom, Jessica, homeschools Jackson, and hands-on learning is often part of the curriculum. Can I just drop it on my hand? Yep, and then you gotta keep it from kind of dropping. Sometimes, lessons are learned on a field trip to Grandpa's. That transmission is nice to shift through. I, I like how easy it is. Yeah. That's why I like the John Deere's, their transmissions are nice. Grandpa Tracy was a former dairy farmer who now passionately shares his knowledge with Jackson. He teaches me some things once in a while. I was going to say. <laughs> some youngsters seem to have it and others don't, you know. And you think Jackson has I, it? I would say he does. <laughs> How are you, Jackson? Good. Jackson's enthusiasm is a source of inspiration and hope for this community where the value of farming runs deep. Got full weights on it. Full weights. And he's not too young to understand the demands of the job. What are the good days look like. Cops are going good. There's not something sitting in the shop or you break something that day. Yeah. That's a good day. And then a bad day? Stuff's breaking. Stuff's not working. Crops aren't going good. There's water in your field. You gotta go fix stuff. It just, that's a bad day. <laughs> a small town boy with a big personality and a bright future rooted in farming. What do you want to be when you grow up? A farmer and a trucker. Oh, there you go. There you go. <laughs> so Jackson isn't slowing down this summer. He'll be training John Deere's chief tractor officer. He'll also be making stops at different farm shows in the Midwest. And, of course, he'll be busy farming, growing sweet corn and green beans. Oh, oh, Jackson wow. can do it all. And you know what? I come bearing gifts, actually, courtesy of Jackson and his mom. Thank you. Look at these truck. Oh, these Look at these trucker so hats. And it's and signed. They're signed. And they're signed. Oh, one for all of Thank you, guys. Jackson. You are so cute, Jackson. Jackson you are awesome. Thank oh. you. Jackson, if this you're ever cool. up in New York, feel Come free to by. stop by the studio. Yeah. Right. We're all going to be working for him one day. Yeah. Oh. He can teach you a thing or two. Yeah. No question. Yeah. All right. Thank Here you, sir.